born, raised, and trapped. Welcome back to Every Disney Movie Ever. My name is Justin. I'm watching Every Disney Movie Ever. Today I'm going to talk about The Brat Patrol. The Brat Patrol is a 1986 magical world of Disney television release. It's directed by Molly Miller, cinematography by Fred J. Cohen Camp, editing by Barbara Palmer Dixon and Glenn Farr, music by Jonathan Tunick, and it's written by Chris Carter and Michael Patrick Goodman. Molly Miller is best known for student exchange, Tales from the Hollywood Hills, Parent Trap, Hawaiian Honeymoon, and this. Fred J. Cohen Camp is best known for The Towering Inferno, Patton, The Man from Uncle, and Papillon. Barbara Palmer Dixon is best known for Back to the Future. Runaway and the Skies on Fire. Glenn Farr is best known for The Right Stuff, Commando, Runaway, and Broke Down Place. Jonathan Tunick is best known for Find Me Guilty, Sweeney Todd, Into the Woods, and Beauty and the Beast. Chris Carter is best known for All of the X Files in Harsh Realm. Michael Patrick Goodman is best known for Wanted, Dead or Alive, Angels in Green, and this. The film stars Sean Astin, Jason Presson, Dylan Cussman, Nia Long, and Dustin Berkowitz. Sean Astin plays Leonard and is best known for Lord of the Rings, The Goonies, and Rudy. Jason Presson plays McGeorge and is best known for The Stone Boy, Lady in White, Gremlins 2, The New Batch, and Explorers. Dylan Cussman plays Bug and is best known for Dead Poets Society, Jack Reacher, The Mummy, and Leatherheads. Nia Long plays Darla and is best known for Big Mama's House, The Best Man, The Best Man Holiday, and Boiler Room. Dustin Berkowitz plays Squeak and is best known for Sisters, Big Top Pee Wee, Alien Nation, and this. Brian Keith guest starred in this movie. It was exciting to have a Disney legend in the movie. He was kind of a turd blossom, but it was still exciting to have him. The movie is about five army brats that make up the brat patrol born, raised, and trapped. <laughs> and all the havoc they release on the base and how they have a bad reputation and no one believes them ever when something really does happen and then of course they happen upon this like big weapons selling a legal thing and no one believes them so they have to prove themselves and then they win this award for good deeds it's a very predictable movie it's very kid heisty it's at the height of i feel like kid gang heist movies i mean literally sean astin's in the movie as the leader of the group and he was literally in the goonies as mikey a couple years before this or a year before a couple years before i mean he he's gone through some puberty by this movie but it's Funny. The standout part of this film for me actually is the acting. All the kids were really well casted. Sean Astin's characterization of Leonard was incredible, honestly. He was so annoying and just how he committed to the way that Leonard speaks and just his entire characterization of Leonard was awesome. And then every other character, Dustin as Squeak was adorable. He was so good at that part for that a kid that young. And Dylan and Naya and Jason were all really good at their parts. Jason was so wonderful at being the like, I don't want to do this, man. And like the logic of the group. It was a really fun time to have like a little, you know, kid heist movie again. I would say this is better than Little Spies, but I would not say it's incredible. But I will give it above average like I have some of the other television release movies because I was entertained from beginning to end, but I was a little annoyed and there wasn't a lot of character growth or a lot of lessons or whatever, but it was really fun. The music was very recessed. You know the TV show Recess, the cartoon? The music was exactly like that. <laughs> um, so yeah, I think I'm gonna give it six Marines out of 10. Our total movie count is. Parent Tetzel and Cry Counter are still the same. If you want to keep up with the movie I'm watching when, follow me on Instagram or Twitter and you'll find out what movie I'm watching when. I put up videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Until next time, comment, like, subscribe, and I'm not sure if you are, so you do. And don't be the people illegally selling weapons. Wow, remember when Sean Astin was really good in everything he's in, but he's like not in a lot? I feel like, I don't know. Okay.